Hi! Today I'm going to show you how to make a really simple image using Universe Image Creator. This is the trial version, so it's free for everyone to use. It just comes with less items. So what we're going to start with is I'm going to come up to the toolbar, I'm going to select Starfield, and then I'm going to click anywhere, and voila, my stars are there. So now, up here in the top left corner, there's something called texture. And this is where you can change your color. You can change it to bright red. That's a little weird. <laughs> I can change it to dark red or any other color. But I'm going to keep it white. I can change my brightness, my density, and the size. And when I'm pretty happy with that, I've got my stars all done. I'm going to come back to the tool section. And now I think I want a fire planet. So I'm going to click fire tool and I'm just going to click anywhere. And wow, that is a nice planet. <laughs> and then back to the corner. The first thing we see is geometry. Now this is like where your planet is. So if it's, if you don't have like, an, if you don't have orientation or location selected and you move your mouse around, you just get different views and perspective. So now I want my fire planet. I'm going to click the location button and that now I can click anywhere and it will move my planet around. I'm just going to click, I want it in the corner right here. I'm going to get the orientation. I'm going to move it slightly tilted so I can see its rings better. I'm going to make it the size a little bit smaller until that's smaller. Under that you see the texture. This is your colors and the speed of the fire, I guess. <laughs> I'm going to make it medium speed. And I'm going to change the colors. There we go. Perfect. And then the atmosphere. We have a big atmosphere. Small. And that's that color you see. So I'm going to have a small atmosphere. I'm just going to make it white. And then the rings, the start. It's how far away and how close to the planet it starts. The size of your rings. And fairly big ones. Transparency. And the count. So you can have like couple of big gigantic rings or a lot of small thin ones. They have a couple of gigantic ones. I'm gonna make my rings a light blue or green. A green blue. There we go. Perfect. And then down here we have the lighting. So I can choose the vertical lighting, horizontal lighting, a little bit like that. Perfect. Okay. When I'm done with my planet, now I can add something else I like. So now you can just come up here, play around with things. I think I'm going to add a nebula. Now I can just click anywhere and voila. Nice big cloud of gas. <laughs> so it's the same thing, orientation and location, where you can change it like that. I'm going to change it like whoop, boop, 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 boop. Ah, uh, that was crazy. <laughs> um, I like the location, I like the distance size, I like all that. So now I go down texture where you can change the color. Obviously white. The color white. Um I'll get a little bit of a grayish blue in here. Grayish green. <laughs> nah, too dark. So now you can really just, you know, play with it however you like. I like that, I like it. And then you can change the color mix. You can have a pretty color. The blend, blend factor, fall off, fall off shape, vortex, black hole, and repeat. I'm gonna skip all that and I'm gonna go to vortex. I'm gonna vortex it a little. No, I don't want to vortex. I'll vortex it like that. No. Perfect. Okay, I like that. And then I 
I do not want that. But I do want it to repeat. And then the frequency granularity amplitude and gain. So I just real quick I think we can make it a little bit smaller. Maybe that's a little too small. Uh there, I like that. Okay. Now, when you're done, you can go up here to the commands and then click Save Image. Here you can write in what do we save as? I'll just call it the Blue Planet. I'm going to change it to dot .jpg because I want to save it as a JPEG. Then I'm just going to make it this, the, the width and height that it recommends. Four samples and nine black one size. And then save. And voila, you are done. Thank you, much, thank you so much for joining me. And y'all, I hope y'all have a nice day. Bye-bye.